they are here to learn how doctors here treat trauma patients and modernize their care in Ukraine. Thank you for coming. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Nice to meet you as well. It's an honor for us to show kind of what we do and, you know, um, kind of share with them our expertise in this, in their, in this area, um, kind of also learn, you know, what their approach to care is and, you know, give them useful things that will help all of the, um, you know, the patients who are wounded back in the Ukraine. So we have four hyperbaric oxygen chambers here. The visiting doctors got a look at the hyperbaric oxygen therapy center that is used to treat infections in limbs. We have four chambers. They wanted to know how U.S. doctors deal with wound care, amputee rehabilitation, and orthopedics. We are uh, getting many wounded patients, many wounded soldiers, and yeah, it's enormous number of patients we are working a day, so it's very difficult. Taras Voloshin is an orthopedic doctor and spine surgeon in Ukraine. He says he sees many blast injuries, the most difficult and severe injuries. Some of them are amputees. We are trying to save their limbs. We are using lots of plastic surgery, like we do plastic surgery to manage soft tissue problems. So we can um, simulate cars of any height that the patients might need to get into. He says he's grateful for the opportunity to come here and make contacts he can call on for help. With doctors, with uh, uh, physiotherapists, with uh, prosthetic uh, providers. Members of the delegation are here for eight days. They are staying with host families. Lisa Robinson, WBAL TV 11 News.